And now the 22 News Storm Team forecast. Let's take a look at our Greenfield live camera 711. That's actually very funny. <laughs> this morning we're seeing a bit of a sun cloud mix. We could see a little bit of cloud cover, but that sun is peeking through in some places. Chicopee, not as much. A lot of cloud cover in Chicopee, but again, some slight places you can get a little bit of, a little bit of sunshine, but that cloud cover does increase as we go into the evening. Our forecast focus for today, mostly cloudy skies. There is another possibility for a flurry going into the early afternoon, but it's not going to get anyone too wet or cover any driveways. President's Day tomorrow, mostly sunny skies, temperatures remaining in those mid 30s, but we do have a chance for some late week rain and snow. We're going to be it's going to be quite a while till we see any more snow. Our 22 new storm team ESP live Doppler radar showing no rain or snow now, but we are not, but we could see a flurry later in the day. We'll show you why with our clouds and radar. Getting that snow in upstate New York that could potentially make its way into western Massachusetts. Again, that's mainly going to be reserved for a little later in the morning, early afternoon, but again, not going to be too much of an inconvenience. Temperatures now are a little more inconvenient. Pretty cold outside, temperatures in the high teens, low 20s. Northampton and Westfield at 19, Greenfield at 20, Orange at 17. Berkshire County seeing high teens in Pittsfield and North Adams and low 20s in Great Barrington. Temperatures throughout the day are only going up into the low to mid 30s, 34 at around 3 p.m., close to our high for the day. And going into the overnight, temperatures are going to be very similar to what they are now, mainly in the low 20s. But along with these lower temperatures, we're also seeing some higher wind gusts. Not as much this morning. Wind gusts this morning are mainly going to be in the mid to high teens. But going into the afternoon is going to be a bit of a different story. Over 20 mile an hour wind gusts in most places around western Massachusetts, topping out anywhere from the mid to high 20s. And this also goes into the evening as well for places in Berkshire County. Not as much for the Pioneer Valley, mainly going to be a calm day, calm evening, excuse me, tonight. Our 22 New Storm Team Skycast showing us that we do have that cloud cover, but again, those pockets of sunshine at around 7 a.m. this morning. Now, going into the afternoon, we see that cloud cover start to build up a bit more. Some pockets of sunshine remaining, but mostly cloud cover going into the afternoon. Four o'clock today, we can expect a possible flurry, mainly going to be for places in, in the Berkshires or in Hampshire or Franklin County. As we go into the evening, we do start to see that cloud cover clear up 12 a.m. Monday morning. We're seeing a much clearer night and a clearer start to the day tomorrow, 6 a.m. Monday morning. We do see only a couple bits of clouds and throughout the day, not going to be seeing anything in terms of cloud cover. 12 p.m. Monday going all the way throughout the evening and the overnight. Going to be pretty clear going through Monday and Tuesday. Tuesday at around noontime. We're expecting those clear skies to remain. Temperatures today, very similar to yesterday. 32 to 36 is our range of highs, mostly cloudy skies, and those breezy conditions coming around in the afternoon. Tonight is going to be, it's going to be cool, not as chilly as last night. 20 to 26 is our range of lows with mostly clear conditions. And our 22 new storm team, seven day forecast, showing us that we do have a couple days of sunshine Monday through Wednesday. Cloud cover that's building up on Thursday will result in a chance of showers and some snow on Friday. But today we are going to deal with the last bit of that cloud cover for the weekend, a high of 34. Temperatures steadily increasing Monday and Tuesday into the high 30s before we reach the low 40s Wednesday and Thursday. And we get colder temperatures this weekend, but Friday does see a chance for rain and snow all throughout the day. If you want to stay up to date with all of our latest forecasts, you can check out our website, wwlp.com, or, or download the free 22 News mobile app.